netflix.com slash TYT and you get a month free. A man in Sydney, Australia got into a severe car accident and uh, suffered injuries for it. So he uh, was awarded a payout of $1.4 million. All right. mm -hmm. He spent thousands of dollars on uh, brothels and prostitutes. So his wife of 24 years took him to family court uh, to have him pay the funds back to their joint account. Mm -hmm. uh, well, the judge ruled in favor of the gentleman who was visiting the broth brothels and said that, well, he's been taking care of his family, he takes care of his three kids, he doesn't need to pay the wife back. Wow, that's a really interesting case. I think we we're going to have to do a little TYT Supreme Court on this. Yeah, we might. Okay, because on the one hand, so the wife winds up paying the bills for your hookers. That's pretty cool. I mean, that's terrible and outrageous. Um, uh, so, of course, I feel her pain. On the other hand... Yeah, it's his settlement, you know? You're insane. It's his settlement, and Jay, what, like, he wants to use it on hookers. The reason why he got that settlement is probably because he suffered injuries that uh, made it difficult for him to work and yeah. make an income. So that $1.4 million is supposed to take care of him and his family. Well, okay? oh, it's Instead, taking care of him. by the way, his wife of 24 years, he's not some single guy. If he's a single guy, go do whatever the hell you want with that settlement. I don't care. But you're using money from your joint account with your wife so you're saying that a, a, a guy can't ever use money from a joint account for hookers and massages? Okay, you're messing with me, so I got it. <laughs> now look, of course he shouldn't do it, right? He's married, obviously. This is very obvious, right? But that's not the issue. The issue before the judge is, you know, can he do it? And my guess is probably yes. So, I'm, so I think we have a little disagreement. Uh, Just Jackson. Am I missing a part of this? They, he got $1.4 million. It's the family's money, apparently, right? He spent some of it. She took him to court because of what he spent it on? Yeah. Are his kids starving? I mean, I just wonder. And even if they are, is this a court issue? Are they divorced? Is, does he have child support? Something. Is there something legal that he has to do because of this money? Or is it just dumb? Because it's dumb that he did it, obviously. But... Mm -hmm. That's what I'm wondering. I, he, there's no responsibility that, that, that I don't think the court has to tell us when, what they can do with their money, even though he does stupid things. Like if he bought a Ferrari, that's stupid. But yeah. she can take him to court for it? See, that's, that's where I was going with this. Uh, I agree with JR. Because what if he uh, just spent even more money gambling? That's really dumb, mm -hmm. right? But what, you're not going to let the guy gamble? Uh, okay, you're not going to let the guy do anything? I mean, what's, I'm, so... That's not the issue here, though. It has nothing to do with gambling. It has to do with him traveling to the Philippines for hookers. <laughs> uh, that was another part of the story that amused me. <laughs> He's like, yeah, yeah, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Just got a, a little jaunt to the Philippines. Right back. <laughs> then it, come to find out, it turns out he's getting hookers and massages in the Philippines. Who would have figured? <laughs> so, anyway, so you're look, very clear look, on it. Yeah. Uh, it seems like JR is on my side. But what is your side? I, uh, is, the question, is the question, should this be a court issue? No, I don't think this should be a court issue. I don't think that the, any judge should even waste his time listening to this case. Should this guy somehow find a way to pay back? Yes, I do think he should. Uh, because he's married. I, I don't understand. Am I the crazy one here? Sometimes the thing, I say things and I feel like they're the most obvious thing in the world, but everyone is like, no, 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 it's not. But who's going to make him? This guy is fucking some other woman while he's married to a woman for 24 years. But who's going to make him is the thing. I don't know. I don't know who's going to make it. So that's why this judge has to say, handle it, you guys. You're married. What am I going to do about it? Right. You know? If she divorces hey, him. Hey, yeah. hey, hey, JR, isn't Anna crazy? No, you know what? But that's, that's the thing. That's the thing that sucks about doing a show that's dominated by males. Because I say stuff like this, and I feel like I'm crazy. I, to me, this is the most obvious thing in the world. You're married to a woman for 24 years. You're using money from your joint bank account to cheat on her with hookers in the Philippines. How is that okay? okay. Should I think a judge should listen to this case, and should a judge rule in favor? Okay, I'm fucking done. <laughs> no, I'm done. I'm done. And you know, let me just say one more thing, okay? I always get shit for agreeing with you guys. Like, oh, yeah. Anna's just there to look cute and she agrees with the guys I disagree with you guys on almost everything okay sorry that's just a vent that I had to get out the woman comes in and says you know he'd been in the Philippines going to work on these Filipino ladies okay and tag along this and tag along that right and then it come to find out he's using our joint account I'd be like none of my business next <laughs> okay <laughs> like I hear you you're right and I feel for your pain but 
the kids are not starving, their thing, and then that's your business, not my business. All right. Okay, that's all. Did you know the Young Turks have a new sponsor? Netflix. You get a free trial membership. Save $8.99. Get a month free. Netflix.com slash TYT.